All your wishes have been granted. Farewell. Hey. hey, can you hear me? I see you're awake. How are you feeling? Yes, I suppose I should introduce myself first. I am 16, an android created by the Red Ribbon Army. You probably don't understand what's going on right now, but please stay calm. We don't have much time, so I'll be brief. Right now, you're linked with an alien named Frieza. Basically, it's like you've possessed Frieza's body. It may be easier if you just take a look for yourself. It may surprise you, but this is all real. We were planning to link your soul with Goku's, but one thing led to another, and you ended up linked to Frieza. This may sound strange, but just relax. There's a way for you to return to your body. It's... Oh, hello. Can you hear me? If you can hear me, then answer me. It seems as if Frieza's soul has awakened. Frieza can hear my voice, but only you can hear his. Now, try saying something to Frieza. You've got some nerve to ignore me. You're either brave or stupid. You'd better watch how you treat me, or I will eradicate you. You have arrived, finally. Let's just say, good thing you weren't another minute late. I don't need to explain things, do I? Now then, there are several questions I have for you. First, I want you to begin by explaining to me what's happening right now. I'm just glad there are no parades here, like in that hell of a flower garden. Silence, scum! You know absolutely nothing about the hell I've been put through! Day after dreadful day, they forced me to watch that painfully awful, cheerful parade! Just thinking about it fuels me with enough rage to lose my mind! I'm so angry. I could erase you right here and now! Tell me all you know, every little bit. Unless you want to make me even angrier, obey me, or you will regret it. Frieza, can you hear me? I don't know how much you heard but there's no time for a full explanation. I'll summarize the important points. By using the Link system, another soul has taken over your body. You will not be able to use your power, nor will you be able to defeat enemies. <laughs> okay, enough with all these stupid jokes. Time to get serious, or I am going to erase you right here and now. How impossible it is for someone to ever take me over! Are you listening to me? I've received no response. Are you two conversing? Well... I suppose there's no use in pondering it. I'll just continue with the conversation. 
What? This can't be! I attacked just now. Why did nothing happen? This will not stand! Just so you know, going wild inside your mind will change nothing. You just need to give it up and listen. <clears throat> there is only one way to fix this situation. Listen, you need to allow that soul to control your body and experience as many battles as possible. Let it control me? You mean my only hope is to let someone else use my body as they please? That isn't even remotely funny. Now if you would, please stop standing there and give me back my body. Otherwise it would be my pleasure to erase you from existence. I may not be able to do anything on the outside, but you and I are both on the inside. Long enough. I have now run out of patience. I need to talk with that man, so get out of my way. Don't make me repeat myself. so glad we can now finally talk to one another. But I'm not interested in hearing your excuses. The soul inside you must have handed off control. I guess this will make things faster. Enough small talk. Now, prepare to die. Ugh. But I thought I regained control over my body. Now do you get it? Your only hope is to leave the fighting to the soul inside you. The power of the Link allows you to move, but if it's removed... <laughs> you are going to pay for this! Not only did you seal away my power, but you also let this Cretan possess me! Just so there are no misunderstandings. I was the one that started up the Link system, but your power was sealed by a different person. What? Why? Her name is Android 21, the current leader of the Red Ribbon Army. If you fight a great deal and power yourself up, you may be able to stop her. May be able to stop her? Don't you know who you're dealing with? If what you say is the truth, then all I need to do is erase her. If you do that, you will never get back to normal. What do you mean? Are you trying to threaten me? Only she knows how to break the seal on your soul and your power. This is truly ridiculous. Do you really think that any of this is believable? Still, at this rate, we're never going to get anywhere. I hope you listened to all of that just now. You worthless earthling maggot. It appears that my only way out of this extremely vexing situation is to let you fight. Unfortunately for you, there is just no other option. From now on, you are my servant. Fight like your life depends on it, and make sure you don't disgrace me out there.
got it. Well, you're an impudent one. Well, you're a good Keep at it. It's clear you have a death wish. It's clear. That won't do. Well, you're an impudent. Well, you're an impudent one. Well, you're a Can't you do any better? It's clear you have a death wish. Die in the vacuum of space. Well, you're an impudent one. Well, you're an impudent one. Destroy everything! 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 Oh my, it talks. This one seems a little different than all those other pathetic specimens. I'll tear you limb from limb! Well, it may be capable of speaking, but it seems just as pitifully stupid as the others. Oh well, might as well kill a little time with a display of my superior strength. Ha! 
Huh? What's going on? I thought you were just another Cretan, but you actually have a modicum of skill. Well, I did go a little easy on you, but you still survived my attacks. Wait, please! Is that you? Lord Frieza? Oh, so you do know your place after all. Please, forgive me! It's me, Nappa, the Saiyan. I used to work for you. Don't you remember me? Nappa. Hmm. Now that you mention it, that name does ring a bell. My apologies, Lord Frieza! It's it just... You, you've changed forms from, from when I last had the honor of meeting you. Oh, so this was the first time you've seen me in my current form, then? Still, if one cannot recognize one's master, does that not constitute an absence of loyalty? Oh, of course not! Come hell or high water, I would do your bidding to the letter, Lord Frieza. I wouldn't need to test you on that statement now, would I? But if you do mean it, you will devote your life to serving me. Is that clear? That wasn't terrible. Seems like you might have a knack for this. If you can tap into a little more of my power, we should be able to interrogate Android 16. Silence, fool. I do not care what you prefer. What could possibly be wrong with punishing a fool like him? I urge you to learn your place. There is no doubt about it. You can't actually believe anything that comes out of that man's mouth. If so, you are a puke-inducing simpleton. I don't know what his true goal is. But he must be hiding something. Oh, I see. Now I understand. It seems like he originally intended to link you with that Saiyan after all. That Saiyan? Hey, you talking about Kakarot? And since when have you been allowed to speak to me in that manner? Shall I remove that big mouth of yours? Oh, no, no, Lord Frieza. It was just my misunderstanding. I thought it was the maggot inside of you speaking, Lord Frieza. <laughs> I sincerely hope that's the case. Nabba. Even you could prove to be an important pawn in a situation this dire. I trust you know what will happen if you don't show adequate results. Of course I do, sir! I won't let you down! Now that's more like it. I expect great things from you. Tch, that Frieza's such a jerk. Did you say something? No, sir, not a thing!
So there's somebody in this world that looks just like me, huh? Kinda creepy. Whoever created this good-for-nothing wannabe won't get away with it! After taking care of this guy, I'm gonna hunt down its maker and make him wish they'd never been born! Actually, this being my clone and all, could make things kind of fun. <sighs> Time to show you how powerful the real deal is!
<laughs> ah, Captain Ginyu, you have returned to life at a most opportune moment. Come along, then. You work for me now. Beware, you little fool! I'll destroy anybody who gets in my way! First he forgets to pose, and then he ignores Lord Frieza's direct command? It does seem that you forgot your place under me when you fixed that odd little posing habit of yours. My dear Captain, I'll see to it you remember who follows the orders around here and who will be the one giving them. Your excuse may be, I cannot accept insurrection in the ranks. However, I'm willing to let it slide just this once, as I am in need of able-bodied fighters. Lord Frieza, do... do you really mean that? I do, but in exchange, I expect you to serve me until your dying breath. Thank you, Lord Frieza. You have my word. I promise I won't let you down again. Listen up! The merciful Lord Frieza has given us a chance to return to his army. Now we will express our eternal joy and gratitude in the form of a dance! You really needn't bother. Oh, as you wish, my lord. Pardon my asking, Lord Frieza. But is it really a good thing they're back to normal? Seems to me they were better off the way they were before. I see your point. But in my army, all that matters is results. Apologies for the wait, Lord Frieza. The Ginyu Force has assembled. How excellent. I'm expecting great things from you and the Ginyu Force. Thank you, Lord Frieza. Honestly, it is truly an honor to serve you again. Shall I perform my dance of joy to express how delighted I am? If you'd like, I can perform a special version of the dance. <laughs> the dance of joy! Awesome! And it's the special version, too. No, that's unnecessary. Let's save the dancing for later, shall we? As you wish. After the matter is resolved, the Ginyu Force and I will perform the most splendid dance for you. I'm looking forward to your recital. Listen up! This is our chance to impress Lord Frieza. I want all of you to practice until showtime. You can count on us, Captain Ginyu! Whether it's on the battlefield or off, we'll be sure to dance in Lord Frieza with our moves. All right, man. Now that that's decided, let's show this enemy the might of the Ginyu Force. Ginyu Force, let's go! Yes, sir! I do wish he'd do something about that eccentric personality of his. The 
battle's about to start. Good luck! Very good. Now that we have Captain Ginyu with us, I would say things are going quite well. Lord Frieza, are you sure it's okay? 
to let that Earthling freeloader remain in your body. Of course not. I detest the thought. But I need that maggot to draw out all of my power. When you consider the dangers we face, letting a maggot roost in one's body doesn't seem that bad. All things considered, I'd like to gather us some more pawns, however. So, they revived you too. Now, things are getting interesting. Hey! What business do you have with Lord Frieza? My name is Cell. I would be more than happy to join, if you're sure you want to play. What? Behave, Nappa. You will soon learn that. Smart mutts know when to stop their barking. But, but sir, Nappa, Lord Frieza gave you an order. Your subordinates seem rather undisciplined. Is the Frieza Force nothing but a group of halfwits? Hey, you better watch your tongue. Captain Ginyu, not you too. I think it's best to hear what Bug Boy has to say. <laughs> Lord Frieza just saved your life, punk. All right then, let's get down to business. Where is the being who revived me and allowed some strange soul to take complete control of my body? Strange soul? You mean they did the same thing to you? Perhaps she plans to utilize many more people than we realized. Excuse me? Did you say she? So you do know something about this? Even if we did, who says we need to share this with you? I do. First, you need to show me some respect. Ask me nicely, and I just may consider it. Hmm. What an unbelievably banal request. I don't care what you Tell me everything you know. I see. It would appear that this fellow is much slower in the head than I first assumed. Isn't that special? No matter. I'll just have to teach you the hard way. Brace yourself for the coming battle! I guess it's not that bad. You seem much different from the data I have on you. It's like you've become something completely different all of a sudden. Why is it, Frieza? I'm getting the sense there's another energy inside you. You are somehow different from me. Like you've been possessed by another being's soul. If we're so different, then please explain what it is inside of you. Ah, well that is another story. I have something akin to an artificial soul that has been pre-programmed, which would explain why I find it so easy to control. What? You can control the soul inside you? Indeed. In fact, it was so easy to overpower that I didn't even need to waste my time and effort expelling it. Hmm. I don't know who's inside of you right now. But thanks to their soul, your full power is at your disposal. I'm correct, aren't I? Surely, being linked with this Earthling must be what allowed me to tap into some of my power. Although, my true power is so much greater than this. Interesting. There must be some logical mistake then. 
The data I have on you must be outdated. Amusing. How about I allow you to come and work for me? Lord Frieza, if I may, I don't believe it would do us well to work with this creature. I agree. There's no telling when that freak might betray us. None of this matters. Cell doesn't work for anyone. However, you could all prove to be of actual use to me. I suppose I don't mind teaming up, at least temporarily. So be it. I suppose there are small benefits in a group effort. Nevertheless, if you prove useless or dare to betray me, then I will be forced to erase you. No hard feelings. <laughs> the same goes for both sides. Wow, things are getting interesting now. Something happened? It looks like Cell has joined forces, with Frieza of all people. What? I've never seen you look like that before. <laughs> you do get surprised. Although, is it really that much of a surprise? Both of them were uncontrollable, so it might have just been a matter of time. True. But are you sure this is okay? They could pose a threat together. Not necessarily, Sixteen. The one who truly poses a threat is the soul inside Frieza. The live human soul is the real reason why Frieza was able to draw out so much of his power. I've been watching and trying to figure out why a human ended up getting linked to him. But this link is too dangerous to ignore. We need to act fast. Eighteen, you need to go defeat Frieza and Cell. Think of it as your link test. Sure, not a problem. I'll destroy anyone who gets in my way. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. I'm excited to watch you. Meanwhile, Sixteen, you need to prepare a snack for when she gets back. Understood. Well, I guess it's time to go hunting. 